This video is proudly brought to you by Hovertech. Hovertech. Just a button away. In this guide, we'll be treating how to fix the Wi-Fi NVRAM 0x10 error on your Technophone. Now, this error could come to be when you flash a custom ROM, which is incompatible, or maybe use SP flash tool, or even sometimes under settings, if you do a factory reset under settings, you could get this issue. Now, the origin of this issue, the, the genesis of this issue is a corrupt or a missing Wi-Fi file. So the aim here is to fix that Wi-Fi file. Now you would usually get something like this on your phone when you have an NVRAM issue. Okay, when you when you launch your when you launch your Wi-Fi, you will see something like this. If I wish to connect, for example okay wi-fi networks available so i get all excited uh, yeah you can see nvram warning error 0x10 now this guide is basically going to teach you how to fix this issue now first things first we need to turn this off all right now the first thing you need to do is to extract this wi-fi file the file we are going to be fixing, we are going to copy it out, fix it, then put it back in. So to do this, we need ROM toolbox. So I'll launch it. I'm on my home. Okay. I launch ROM toolbox. All right. So from the home directory here, I go to the data folder. Data. I scroll down to NVRAM nvram folder nvram then apcfg at the top aprdeb folder the bottom here i have my wi-fi file the third one so what i'm going to do here is to copy this file then i click the home icon at the top left corner of my phone that returns me to the root directory that is the home directory and then I'll just go paste this file in my memory card. Paste. Okay, I have an existing copy of this, so I'll just overwrite. Now that I have this here, I have it on my memory card. I'll be editing it on my PC. But before I edit on my PC, I need to get my I need to get my MAC address. That's the MAC address of the phone. So to do this, I'll go to about, that's under that settings, about, status, okay, and here I have my MAC address. So I'll just type this out, neatly write it out here, 00082220101C zero a so i'll just confirm the zero 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 eight two 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 zero sorry about that zero 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 eight two 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 zero one c zero a okay now that i have my mac address i can proceed to my pc but first i need to copy the wi-fi file which i just copied to my memory card to the pc and i'll do just that I've copied my Wi-Fi file to my PC. Here it is. So what I'm going to do now is to edit this file using Hex Editor. So I'll just launch Hex Editor here. So I'll drag this over here. Okay. What what I would want to do here is to open this. Then you select the Wi-Fi file. That is the Wi-Fi file. Just copy to the PC and then open. Now the target here is this first row. This row you are going to be editing this row. 
and replacing some values here with your MAC address. And your target is basically this column 4 to 9. From column 4 to 9, we replace these zeros with your you replace these zeros to your MAC address. So my MAC address is here. I'll just replace this. So I have a 00, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 8 2 2 0 1 c 0 a all right so i have that here so i'll just drag this off the screen now you would want to save this and close hex editor now you see i have two wi-fi files this wi-fi dot back is the backup of the original Wi-Fi file I copied to the PC before I began editing. Now, Hex Editor automatically makes a backup of this file just in case I need the original file I imported or maybe something went wrong and I want to revert the change. All I will do is just delete this edited Wi-Fi file, then rename this back to Wi-Fi by, by deleting the .back extension. You understand? So it's just basically like a, a a precautionary measure on the side of X editor but i don't need the i don't need to delete this edited wi-fi file so i will just escape the process all right so this is the file i will be sending back to the phone so the file is now on my phone that is the wi-fi file so what i'll be doing now is to replace that existing Wi-Fi file with this new modified or edited Wi-Fi file. So I'll just go back the same way I went in the very first place. Home directory. Now what you want to do here is to first go to the memory card and copy the modified Wi-Fi file. Now we'll just go back okay, here it is. I'll copy this then i go back to the home directory data folder here it is nvram here we are apcfg remember aprdeb then delete this existing wi-fi file yes to confirm and then paste the copy the Wi-Fi file. So what you want to do here is to set adequate permissions. Read, write, read, write, read, write. Okay. All right. So I will just confirm that my MVRAM issue is fixed. Okay, here we are, no more NVRAM. 